Well, hello. Today I'm going to show you how to remove uh, clicks from vinyl records using Audacity, the program Audacity. And of course you can download Audacity free. I'm not going to show you how to do that or um, how to record a track. I might do that on a future video. But we have our track recorded which is uh, Peter Gabriel's Sledgehammer. I've been recording a lot of 45s um, onto iTunes and making myself a uh, uh, iTunes on jukebox. So tonight I, I uh, just recorded Sledgehammer onto uh, Audacity and we're going to cl clean up the clicks. This record was in really, really good shape but you still have those uh, pops and clicks. and the pops and clicks you see where I'm pointing here where it goes out of the wavelengths all, all those right there uh, when when the sound crosses over there you hear the pops and we'll I'm gonna play it for you right now You hear all that? I'll, I'll play it again. I'll turn it up just a little bit more. Okay. We're going to get rid of those. What we do is go up to uh, edit. Get a uh, zoom it in for you. Zooming in a little bit more. There, we go up there to edit. And then go down to um, select. And we're going to select the entire track and it turns a darker color. And um, then we're going up to effects. Right up there. Right there. Effects. Bring it down. And there's something called click removal, which I'm going to point to. And I find my best setting on this. There's two directors. Select the thrust hole lower and more sensitive. I usually keep it right there. Uh, max spike with higher, more sensitive. I don't know what that means. I'm not a sound technician, but I usually bring that over. And that's my own default setting. We're going to hit click remove. And it's doing its thing. Okay, they're all gone except one right there. I might have to go back and work on that. So we'll hear a click there, but I'll play the uh, the ending again. Okay, a lot quieter. Whoops, didn't mean to do that. I'll stop it. Okay, um, I'm recording and... Okay. Final lives. Holly just handed me a... Ooh, what did she just hand me? Look at here. It's a store. Yeah, I'm going to have to check this out. Uh, vinyl lives their largest like new bookstore also thousands of generally pre enjoyed and new releases vinyl records and turntables groovy I had to check that out okay so we got rid of the uh, clicks and pops we're gonna 
put this at the very beginning. Whoops. We still got So what I'm going to do about that is that sound right there. When you have a uh, intro into the record that's quiet with some noise, you're going to have um, not click and pop, but still some vinyl noise. So what I'm going to do, I mean, I could work on that and, and you know eliminate it some more. But what I'm going to do is go there and hit delete. Where's my delete button? Right there. There we are. So, we can go right to the record. I don't think the camera really caught that because I had it up too close. So we're going to undo that real quick and I'm going to show you again. All the silence, I mean, um, intro, quiet, intro part. I'm going to pick, choose it. And hit delete. And I only left a few, like a, a second right there. Pretty cool. Bring it all the way towards the end. Let's hear the ending. What I'm going to do here is I'm not going to this click that remained. What I'm going to do is uh, choose that area of the fade out, get rid of it, and then choose a little bit more of the fade out. Go, go to effects right there. Back to effects. And f fade out. right there hit fade out and it fades gives you a fade out so let's listen to the ending okay so So I don't want to play too much because I put this on YouTube and I get a little warning of copyright infringement. But I wanted to show that you, you can clean up uh, the clicks and pops. Uh, a little bit more difficult with uh, records that have quiet intros or ending. You still get some surface noise, but the pops and clicks are gone. Um, I'm going to put this song on my iTunes under the 45s and use this as the clip art. Got the camera too far, too far away. The original 45 sleeve for the 45 and uh, we'll, we'll be good to go. Thank you for so much for listening. Bye bye.